Hey, YouTube, what's going on, y'all? Kyle here, checking out with another video. Hey, today, hey, today, this video is the rise of DMV rap. Let's go and get into this video. All right, for the past few months, I've been seeing DMV music going crazy on TikTok. Rappers like Jay Chino, have emotion. And you know, Paige been going crazy. I just woke up this morning, I'm loaded to our P20s and start up the day. Hey, y'all gotta start asking me to react to bro. I tried to, bro. I tried to, bro. The shit get blocked every time. I don't know. I don't know. The shit get blocked every time. My mama just want me to stay out of the way. And if you're not from over here, you're probably thinking, look, uh, the DMV, the Department of Motor Vehicles, they got music? <laughs> you mean lobby music? Boy, I jump out the screen and start the shit out of you. When I say DMV, I mean DC, Maryland, and Virginia. So basically, the whole district, counties in Maryland, like Prince George's, Montgomery, and counties in VA, like Fairfax, Alexandria, and Arlington. And to my DMV heads, would y'all include Waldorf? I really don't know, because no. they're relevant for being irrelevant in these type of talks. Fuck it, Waldorf too. Nick is dead. Waldorf definitely not in a DMV, I'm sorry to tell you. You probably listen to that's from this area is... And that's coming from somebody that's from Uptown DC. That shit is not in... Wherever the bus or the metro train can go to, that's where you going. We ain't talking no Greyhound. We ain't talking Richmond, Virginia. You get on a Greyhound bus and it take you two hours. To, like no, no. If you ain't go, if you don't got no bus train, a bus line like your bus connection go there, or the train can't go there. Your shit ain't there. Corday, Logic, Brent Fias, Shy Glizzy, Zaman, Young Manny, and Rico Nasty for my beautiful all princesses that do no wrong. I also know how to cook and shut the fuck up. Just like anywhere else, the DMV got their own style. We were newbies, you know the shit the entire nation stole from us. Our own slang, like Glizzy, the one the entire nation stole from us. And we got our own sick. Glizzy's was never no motherfucking hot dog, by the way. Glizzy's is for a Glock. That's what it is. Glizzy is a Glock. Get your sauce. Mumble sauce. Oh, you yes. know. The one that y'all are ready to steal from us too. Our music scene is what I'll say is unique as fuck. And I mean it in a good way. If I meant it in a bad way, I would have just said Milwaukee music. We got go go music. We got our own flow. And we also have the dreaded free car music. Free car music is as nigga as it can get. Free car music is basically our version of drill. Instead of a nigga in Tim's and a Dominican grandma, imagine some petite ass nigga in a little ass tank top, little ass jeans, and either wearing Dior shoes, newbies, or Balenci track runners. Oh geez, I almost forgot the fake ass Cartier frames they got from Panabai. How can I ever forget? They used the last bit of key they have in their tank with a side of malice to make the most ignorant song ever. And said song, they would be talking about slotting on ops, crushing ran through whores that love trick or treating, stealing whips as the name of the subgenre states, and wanting their men free. Whole time, they finna meet them in the slammer after dropping this incriminating ass song. So basically, free card music is fent pressed into an mp3. And why do I say this? Cause it does more harm than good. For the past four or some years, we had this cycle where we had a nigga that made this type of music gain traction and then proceed to get locked up. If not that, they pass away. R.I.P. Gunu. Migo Lee at the time was the most popular nigga making free car music, but he got locked. And before he kissed that fresh air goodbye, he dropped this. <laughs> Not gonna lie, this joint right here opened my eyes to our music. Lee was expressing his vulnerability to his lost man's dishy on this track right here. And everything about this song was perfect. The beat was different, the vibes was different, everything about this was different. 
Like, damn, bro, he got me missing this. You could crank to this song. You can cry to this song. As a matter of fact, you can fuck to this song. This is the type of music we need. Music that just about anybody can relate to. Because the free car shit did nothing but poison the youth. We real life got niggas from the biggest houses in the metro slinking iron. We need change fast. And that's when this new wave I was talking about earlier comes into play. Nino Paid been doing his shit lately. And that's off the strength of making only pain music. His beat selection is A1. It reminds me of Lil Tony's beat selections. He's not generic, and outside of music, he seemed like he got a good personality. I remember in this one track, Nino said, Niggas never let me use they lunch code. Y'all better not ask me for shit. I'm not gonna lie, this shit had me fried, bruh. That nigga took that shit to the grave. Like, damn, Slim, you not my responsibility. The fuck? Do I look like your dad? Hey, but I'm not gonna hold you. This high school bar right here is real as shit. And one more note, y'all. He don't look like I'm not gonna hold you. This high school bar right here is real as shit and one more note y'all he don't look like duke dennis y'all better stop playing with my mans he, he was putting do. in pain as a thunder there might be a lot of niggas out there that might dick eat and call his shit emo music but really he just be venting on a beat if the music don't involve switches and lean they don't want any part of it niggas will be niggas also one thing about city subreddits is that they always have a whole bunch of dweebs gossiping about street shit like some hoes um, do you guys think that Gunna should be allowed back in his hood after snitching? Whole time, they got a three-car garage and a personal chef. Jay Shino also been doing his thing. He be rapping with a DMV flow and got his own style with it too. He delivers in a more chilled way, the same way Baby Smooth and Lucky does. I feel like I'm dirt on my old time, ever got my mouth in the drink, free doctors the best. That nigga Birdie was told in the ghost, six shots in the drink, and I'm screaming out. Oh, yeah. We don't take none home, bloody tech, blood bros, indirect, for them hoes, fuck a tech, baby show, is it true? And he hates this free car shit as much as I do. Yeah, cause the, the, the free car music, that shit is dangerous, bro, I don't fuck you. Having motion is also up there. I'm not as tapped in with his discog as I am with the other niggas, but I can respect what he's doing for the scene right now. But that'll do it for this video. I'm not a DMV page, so don't expect me to make DMV videos like that. On the next joint, I'm trying to do something completely different. Just let me know if y'all fuck with it or not. As a matter of fact, let me know if you fuck with this video or not. Hey, situation slim. Another golden one. Um, He make like free car music, but he got like his shit is more like lyrical, so like he put more pain into his music too. Like it's more relatable. Um, I'm trying to think who else. Matter of fact, I got my phone right here, nigga. I ain't got to think about nothing. I can go on Apple Music, my damn so. I got y'all. Give me one second. Give me two seconds. Give me two seconds. Uh. Nah, everybody else up here free card music. My bad. Yeah, everybody else. Semi homie. Semi homie. Um, like he already mentioned, Migo Lee. O Dog. High Class. Uh, Yeah, I know. JG Wardy, Young Foot Soldier, Baby Jamo, Giz Wap, Young Threat, Smoke Oh, Smoke Chopo. Hey, Smoke Chopo. Another one. Smoke Chopo. Uh What's Burn name? We got Credit Murder. KP Skywalker. We got uh Cardi is, Um Glock Jones. A lot of people, bro. Kai Glock. Yeah, it's a it's a real it's a bunch of it's a bunch of people, bro. 
trying to see real quick. Yeah, that's just the name of you, man. You see y'all in the next video.